WTFNN. Headline News Update. And welcome to the 2 p.m. update with me, David White on TFNN. What do we have? Well, it is certainly what I was looking for the last couple of days. We had far too many shorts, far too many bears, and uh, they got their hands in the cookie jar today. Up, uh, to, to, let's do it right now, up 73 and a half uh, points on the S&P cash, uh, 587 on the Dow, NASDAQ's up 223, Russell's up 36. Volume's okay. It's not huge. Uh, we talked yesterday on the show uh, in the uh, that we had quite the push down on lighter volume yesterday, uh, opposed to heavier volume on Wednesday, and we were looking for that bounce. Uh, we were also looking for some bounces in some majorly uh, overshorted stocks. A lot of those in the Nasdaq today, and it's up 2.2%. Uh, uh, compared to the S&P, which is up 1.9%. Uh, so, uh, as we said, we'll get into the volume on the show in a few minutes. Uh, but for the most part, uh, we'd been talking on the show about uh, options and how the option market makers uh, were looking for higher prices into uh, the 20th and through the rest of the month. I'm, I'm not really bearish. Uh, I do think that we could get back up uh, maybe into 4,000 or 4,100. It'll uh, probably be a weak bounce, uh, but the uh, real impotence this morning in the numbers uh, is probably inflation being tamed by uh, probably the last couple of months of lower energy prices. My theory is that about 80% of all inflation uh, was based on uh, higher crude prices and it running into everything else. Um, I wouldn't say gas is a, and uh, energy is cheap now, but it certainly is much cheaper. Uh, on the show today, we'll talk about the link uh, because I had a couple emails about it, uh, about uh, natural gas and uh, 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 fertilizers and how that is put together uh, from an earlier question this week on the show. Anyway, hang on for a few minutes and we'll be back. The reality is that navigating financial markets can be risky. Markets can be chaotic and difficult to understand. 